Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. As you can tell by the thumbnail, it's about Lush. I haven't done a Lush video in a while, so I thought I would do one. It's to do with products that are getting discontinued. I'm not going to be able to see, but I brought myself some Lush goodies to stock up for the ones that are getting discontinued and the ones that I like. I will leave all of the ones that are getting discontinued down below in the description box so you can see for yourself. It's going to be a long video if I talked about all of them and I didn't get all of them because I don't really use all of them. So I'm just going to talk about the ones that I like to use and the ones that are going. So sad. <laughs> So first up, I'm going to start with shower because I've only got two products for shower. This one is the Comforter. It's a shower cream. It's my favourite. It smells just like sugar in a bottle. It's very sweet. It's not as sweet as Snow Fairy, if you know what the Snow Fairy smells like. It's more blackberry sweet, so like a fruity sweet. But yeah, it's really nice. It also has almond oil in here, and that's why it's a cream. So it's a little bit more moisturising on the skin, and it feels really good. So I would definitely recommend it if you kind of like the comforter in the bubble bar as well. Definitely try the shower cream, and also stock up because it's getting they're getting rid of it. The next one is Yuzu and Coco. It's a shower cream. It says on here, yes, it smells like chocolate oranges. No, you can't eat it. So basically it smells like chocolate. It's really creamy. It has fair trade organic cocoa butter in there. So that's why this one is a shower cream and not a shower gel because it's much more creamier on the skin. And it smells amazing. Also getting rid of the bubble rune, using cocoa bubble rune in the same scent. So they're getting rid of that whole scent completely. If you don't know what it is, I'm gonna open it up for you. So this is, oh, this one's like melting. As you can see, it's like melted slightly into my hands. Um, but yeah, this is a bubble rune. If you don't know what a bubble rune, well, a bubble bar, this is called a bubble rune because it looks like a macaroon. A bubble bar is when you can break it under the tap, you can reuse it because you don't have to use the whole thing, you get loads of bubbles from just a little bit. And this one in the middle has loads of cocoa butter, so it makes your skin really soft. It also makes the bubbles fluffier. And it just smells just exactly like the shower cream, like oranges and chocolate and coconut and everything amazing. <laughs> Put it everywhere now. So now we're going to move on to, well actually as I was on bubble bars, I'll do the next one. So this is Pink Flamingo Bubble Bar. I've never used this one before so I thought I would give it a go seeing as it's, they're getting rid of it. So this one here is on a stick which means that you can actually swish this around, swish, swish, swish around. <laughs> which means you can swish this around the water. Look how pink it is. You don't have to break it or crumble it, you can just let it do its thing. And then you can leave it on the stick as well. So that's why I kind of like the stick ones, that's why I'm sad this one's going. It smells really fresh. This one inside, this one has rosewood oil, bergamot oil, ylang ylang oil, fair trade organic cocoa butter as well and fair trade shea butter, so it is very creamy. It smells just fresh. It's like a fresh, smells like a cock, I've got on my nose. It smells like a, <laughs> it smells like um, a fresh cocktail. <laughs> but yeah, very pink, very vibrant. If you like sort of fresh scents, I do not wipe myself in the face. If you like fresh scents, then this one is one to grab before they get rid of it. The next one is Big Bang Bubble Bar. So this one, it was actually one of my first ever bubble bars that I got from Lush. That's why I picked this one up. Citrus scent, really citrusy and zesty. And then you've got some cocoa butter in the middle. So the stars and the yellow dots are cocoa butter. So they make the skin really lovely and soft. And you've also got avocado butter in here, grapefruit oil, extra virgin olive oil. It just smells amazing. It's really shiny as well. It's like shimmery. And because it was one of my first ones, I just thought I'd grab it. it smells really good, actually. This is probably one of my favourite Lush products, and they're getting rid of it. Very fresh, again. I'm going with maybe the fresh scent. The ones that I've picked up were mainly fresh scents. Pop in the bath. So I've used this, I used this one the other day, so my mum got one. And it's like a little flower, very floral scented. It has bergamot oil in there as well. You can get two, you can get one that's blue and then with a pink flower on top, or this one which is the opposite way around. 
and it's just very creamy. I think this one does have cocoa butter in it as well because it's just very soft. It's like feels like it's melting in my hand. But if you like a sort of a fresh scent, and also this gives the bath a pink colour as well and a little bit of blue, so it's like a purple lilac colour to the water and it's really pretty. That's it for the bubble bars. Now we're going to quickly move on to bath bombs, which are my favourite and my mum's favourite as well. She loves the bath bombs. Start off with my mum's favourite. Oh, this isn't, this one's not leaving. Then you've got five, so it's going to be very quick. They, these ones are just my favourite ones and these are the ones that are going. Um, so I thought I would just grab them. I think I did get all of the ones that are leaving. So these are all of the bath bombs that are getting discontinued. So this one is Tisty Tosty. It's a really pretty flower one. It's in the shape of a heart. And it smells, to me it smells like baby powder, but I kind of like the smell of baby powder. It's like a fresh scent. And you also get seven flower buds in each one. So it's really pretty, you get, it's like a spa bath. You have bergamot oil, jasmine absolute, rose absolute, so a lot of floral ingredients in this one as you can tell, it's, it just looks very fresh anyway, very white. So yeah, one of my faves. This one I've never actually used, but because it's going I thought I'd grab it anyway. It's frozen bath bomb, so it looks like Elsa's dress, it's very shimmery and blue. You've got the two layers of blue as well, so it looks really cool. It's got bergamot oil in there, neroli oil. Also has snowflake and shimmer glimmer. Glimmer, glimmer. Snowflake and silver glimmer. So it's very shiny and glitzy. Moving on to lava lamp. Lava lamp to me smells like oranges. It's like having a fresh orange. And this one here is a really quick fizzing one, so as soon as you put it in the water it fizzes straight away. Whereas some of them foam up and then they slightly fizz. This also has some polka dots around it which are filled with cocoa butter. So when you put it in the water it, they sort of spread out and that's what makes the water look like a massive huge lava lamp in your bath. And it's very cool. Extra virgin olive oil in there. Organic castor oil. Fair trade organic cocoa butter. Sicilian mandarin oil. Orange flower absolute, so really like a fresh orange sort of scent. If you like oranges, you'll like this one. Two more. Next one we've got, I'll do this one. We've got Blackberry Bath Bomb. This is one of my favourites and I'm very sad it's leaving. It's like a sweet scent but not too sweet. It's nothing like Snow Fairy or The Comforter. It's like a blueberry sweet, so it's a fruity sweet. It's just a really, it's just a very subtle sweet one. And it's really cute, it has the word bomb on the front and it's purple. The water turns to like dark purple and it's really pretty. And then it has a little note inside as well. I think that says bang or bomb, I think it says bomb. Last one really quickly before my phone runs out is my all time favorite. Probably gonna get a few more of these ones before they leave, really sad. It's Fizz Banger. Now, I bloody love this one. It was one of my first ever bath bombs from Lush. It has cinnamon leaf oil in there and ylang ylang oil. So it's like a mix of really fresh but a bit spicy. And that's why I like this one because I don't like too much cinnamon. They bring a lot of cinnamon in the winter collection uh, at Lush. And some of them smell amazing. And this why I like, I think this is why I like this one because it was like an all round product but it had that spice of cinnamon in there as well so it's like a warming bath bomb really nice for when it's like a really cold day and it also has popping candy so it starts to pop and crack once it's been in there for a while and I'm just really sad that this one's going because it's really pretty it makes the water look really cool but that's it that's all of the products that I like, but again, I will leave all of the ones that are getting discontinued, like in mouth care, hair care, I will leave all of them down below in the description box, so just have a look at those. Maybe you can order them online quickly, and just try and get into your nearest store to grab them before they go. If you did like this video and you want to see more Lush related videos, anything, I don't mind, leave it down in the comments below. Ask me if any Lush related questions if you want to. Um, I work for Lush, if you didn't know, so I can try and let you know 
any questions. You're having a really good day, and if you do like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Make sure to hit the subscribe button or press my face at the end, and I will see you soon with another video. Bye.